1973 Rose Bowl game. Is in white today will be Ohio State. They just burst out in the field. Big roar from the stands down below us. Thousands of Ohio State rooters are here, and they're bouncing up and down like yoga sticks, just the way they were against Michigan when they came out of their locker room. Hayes is many things to many people. He's a very articulate man, very bright, and he can talk to young people. He can get them up. So Ohio State now comes to the sideline. Archie Griffin is the middleman, number 45. Bash Nagel, number 48. And Holy Cross, 27, are deep. The wind is swirling around. You can't really tell from what direction it's coming from. Here's the kick. It's a short one. And running up on that one is a freshman, Bashnagel, on the 20, 25, and is spun down in the 28-yard line. Greg Hare will be the quarterback. He's number 18. Archie Griffin, 45. Henson, 38. Galvos, 33, the running back. They're in the robust tier, the old straight tee. Hare on the option is hit by Sims. All right, Smurt has checked in as a tight end now for Ohio State. He's a four-stringer. Ball given off to Griffin, and he's jammed up at his 27. Ohio State, Greg Hare. They run it, they give it to Griffin, and he spills over the 30 to his 32. Game effort of the college season. Okay, okay. Beautiful kick. Beautiful. Back to the 20, it's fumbled, and it's out of bounds on the 15. We'll have Mike Ray at quarterback, number six. Out of their stack eye, Anthony Davis is the tailback, 28. Cunningham's the fullback, 39. Swan is the flanker, 22. Mike Ray is going in motion to Swan. And Davis is hit at the 16-yard line. Mike Ray from Lakewood, California. Anthony Davis again comes over to 20. Amazing balance. McKay will be number 25. In motion to Swan. Davis hit before he could get to the line of scrimmage. Oh, he sort of delays back there. Swan in motion again, a flag down. That's against USC, illegal procedure. Now this is their power eye. Swan in motion. McKay is flanked to the left. Ray for his first pass. Sets up the screen with the 20. Davis out. And is down on his 30-yard line by Rick Middleton. He's going to throw on third and five. He can move. He's under the gun. He's, he's going up desperately. And this one is out of bounds. Average 35 and a half yards. Going against the wind. Kicks it low. Wobble job. Hits on the 45. And he gets a few extra yards in the bounce. And it winds up all right for USC. It's dead on the Ohio State 34-yard line. Greg Hare. For Archie Griffin, a freshman. How about a freshman playing in the Rose Bowl game? Second down, four. Out of their eye. A slot eye. Once again, they run little Griffin, and he breaks it. He's to the 50, and the USC territory. First down, no score. 8.45 to play in the first period. First man through is Randy Keith, the fullback. Out of the slot eye. The hand is to Griffin. He slips away. And this amazing freshman runs it to the 30-yard line. Now they're in a wide slot. With Griffin and Keith. And Randy Keith, the junior from Cincinnati. Archie Griffin. And Morris Bradshaw has gone into the wide receiver, number 25, replacing Mike Bertosi. Hare running the option. The pitch out to Galvis, the wing back. And he appears to be short of the first down. Randy Keith and Archie Griffin are lined up behind Greg Hare. Crowd now has its first suspenseful moment. Fourth and a short yard to go. And it is given to Keith. And it's very close. Very close, and the officials call for the measurement. Oh, USC has held. So far, they've been outplayed by Ohio State. Mike Ray looking down, and he has his man at the 40. And that's Lynn Swan. Now, J.K. McKay is in the game, and Garrison is out as a wide receiver. Davis is slung down there at the 41. Manfred Moore now is in at fullback, replacing Sam Cunningham. Second down eight for USC on their 41. A play-action pass. 
Gets away from Hazenhall to the 40. And then two white shirted Ohio State. Well, he's got time. And Manfred Moore fumbles the ball out of bounds. They're going for it. Fourth down on their 49, fourth and a foot. They have it. Sam Cunningham, who gets that yardage hurdly, are just under five minutes to play in the first period. Fakes it Davis. Flag is down. Here's a deep pass, and it is incomplete, but a flag was dropped at the line of scrimmage. See what he wants to do. He's going to decline it. It'll be second down 10 for USC. Second down 10. In motion is Bullware. The pitch is to Davis. He's got blocking. And he streaks it out. Now first down on the Ohio State 33. Ray under the gun. Throws it out. It's incomplete. Really picked up yardage on first downs this year. There's Davis on that student body right, as McKay calls it. The USC on the Ohio State 28. No score. Four and a half minutes to play in the first period. There it is again. And Davis skips out of bounds. Third down. A fourth down, two and a half. Fourth and two and a half. That's the power eye. Ray is going to throw it. And just as he let it go, he was hit. It's incomplete. Ray is decked. The Ohio State backfield has Griffin and Keith in back of Hare, the quarterback. They give it to Griffin. And Archie Griffin's to the 30-yard line. Both teams have had fourth down play stop deep in the other team's territory. Right on the ground they go. Randy Keith, third down now, and about a half yard to go. Just short of their 35. This is a power attack right here, the old straight T. They give it to Henson, and he wriggles off his left guard. First down, Ohio State on their 36. No score. Late in the first period. Fumble! And it's picked up by USC. Coming up for the ball is Charles Phillips, number 49. Mike Ray puts him down. In motion is Lynn Swan. Fake to Davis. Throws it out to the tight end, Charlie Young, in a crossing pattern. First down, Southern Kelly, Ohio State, 26. McKay is in now as a wide receiver. The flip is to Davis. Davis to the 15 and down to the 10. And he wanted to play uh, baseball at USC under Daydu, their famous baseball coach. Davis hit. Boy, was he decked there at the 10. A great charge by Pete Cusick. Anthony Davis has already made 50 yards in the game. And they're throwing the Swan for a touchdown. Swan for the score. Lynn Swan, a Foster City, California junior. A punt returner, a great pass receiver, and a runner on the flanker reverse. And he was wide open, Jared. Got some good protection. Easy TD. By the way, George Hazenhall. The Pat Hayden holding. Ray's kick is up, and it is good. one is coming to Bashnagel, a freshman on the five. Keeping that ball away from Griffin. He's trying to get outside. Hayes up to the 25, 30. He gets a move here, 40. Beautiful run by a freshman, Brian Bashnagel. USC's had the ball 622, Ohio State seven minutes in the game. There's a pass to Holy Cross, nearly intercepted. Sophomore. Davis is 50 yards, freshman Griffin is 43 yards. Here's the option, they pitch it to Griffin. Gets up to his 45, and they seal him in. And Ed Powell has gone as a defensive end. Here's Hare, his pass is good to the 39-yard line of USC. Tim Holy Cross. And bursting through is Archie Griffin. And the freshman runs it to the 25-yard line. That's the end of the first quarter. The score, USC 7, Ohio State nothing. The first down. Greg Hare to Randy Keith. Gabos at the 15, he is to the 4 and the 3. Rick Gabos. 
Ohio State on the USC three-yard line. USC leading 7-0. Full house backfield. And Randy Keith, number 85, second down, a yard to go for a touchdown. And he's in, Randy Keith. Randy Keith scores. And Ohio State comes right back. Running against the bonded USC defense, ripped them open. Well, we knew this team was ready. We knew it yesterday when we talked to Woody. We A freshman, Bashnagel, holds it for Conway. It is up, and the kick is good. We've got a tie game. The score, early in the second period, Ohio State 7, USC 7. This game is now tied. Ken Kuhn, and he flubbed that one. Grabbed there in the 28-yard line, back to the 30 into the 38-yard line. Senior quarterback Mike Ray, voted the most valuable player in the Pacific Coast Conference, couldn't even make the all uh, the all uh, Pac-18 though. Davis slips away and he's belted out of bounds. Kays to the left, Swans to the right. Ray on a straight drop back. Now he's a scrambler. He throws on the run and heaves it out of bounds. It's third and ten. USC on their 38. And there's a rush again. And he hits his tight end, Young, who made a great play out of that one. Wobbles this one up. And Ohio State will have the ball deep in their own territory. The leading rusher is freshman Archie Griffin with 59 yards. And they run that fullback. Henson comes back in at fullback. Also a wide receiver, Bradshaw's in. They give the ball to Harold Champ Henson. And they stop Archie Griffin. Bad pass, he's in trouble. Hey, he got it away. And bounding around in USC territory and winds up on the USC 45. They're tied seven to seven. They're at least a two touchdown favorite. They're on their 45 yard line. There's the option to Davis. He's up to the 50 and he's bulldog down in Ohio State's 46. Edessel Garrison is flanked outside of him. Second down, a yard to go. And a good down to pass on. He unloads on him. He really unloaded on Ray back in the 37. Swan back in as a slot back. Third down, long yardage. They swing it out to Anthony Davis. Gets away at the 35 and bumped out of bounds on the Southern Cal 41. Nine minutes to play in a half. It's tied 7-7. Seven seven. The low kick. Cross fields it on his 23 to the 25. And slithers through. Nearly got away. First down under 23-yard line. They hold the edge in statistics so far. Griffin is upset at his 24-yard line. Second down, nine. Ohio State sticking on the ground except once. And that's Rick Galbos. Third down. Three to go. Here's the option. Griffin trying to slip outside. You saw those quick feet. He goes out of bounds on his 35. First down, Ohio State on their 35. Pullback, Keith. Yanning ahead, second down seven for the Buckeyes of Ohio State on their 38. Counter play is given off to Keith again. He's to the 41-yard line. Third and four for Ohio State on their 41. And Henson is pulled down on his 44. A bad snap the last time. Fairly good one. And he kicks a low one to Lynn Swan on a 22. Swan at the 25. And is hammered down. 534 to play in the first half. It's 7 to 7. Ray on the option. The Davis. Davis at the 25 to 30. Breaking 40. And is finally hauled down. Anthony Davis. Replaced by McNeil. They have a second down nine. They've been tied 7 to 7 so far. There goes the flag down. There's Davis again squirting through. And he's to the 34 for a first down. We already said the penalty was for illegal procedure. Ray 
flares it out to Davis at the 40. Trying to make his moves and can get it back to the 46 for the third and 12. Deep drop back. Now the scramble. And that pass is it complete? Nobody signaled yet. It must be back, but sometimes it's a crosswind. And he drives this one high and deep. It is bad at back, but it's a touchback. It was in the end zone. Ohio State's ball on their 20-yard line. Game tied, 7 to 7, 219 to play in the first half. And Rick Galbos, Ohio State on their own 27. They have fought USC to a standstill. They run the fullback, Randy Keith, to the 30. Up the middle, that's what they've been doing today. Down in a counter play. Griffin is hit hard at the 34-yard line. Second and six for Ohio State. There's Hare. He's throwing a wobbly pass out to the 50. Third down and six for Ohio State. And they go to the 37. Safety. Very dangerous man. They go after him. And he just got it away. The kicker went down, and he's claiming that he was rough. By number 85 in there. It's a tie game, 7-7. Seven to seven. Ray starts the option, spins it out to Davis. Davis goes for the sideline and is out of bounds. Except for one drive. That's a clipping penalty against USC. First down now. Long yardage, 20 seconds to 6 seconds to go and a half. Ray's going to throw it. And it's at the 40-yard line. The Charles Young is tied in. He's, he has spread him wide. Ray gets out of that pass rush. Broken pattern, maybe, at the 40-yard line. It's to Charlie Young again. The tight end is hammered down at the 33. And a fumble there. A fumble the ball coming up with his Doug Plank, number 28. Down they go to here. They're going to run the clock out. And that's it. That's the end of the first half of the 1973 Rose Bowl game with a score. Ohio State 7, USC 7. If USC opens up the 14 and a half point favorites have been held to the tie. And here's a cross kick, a short one. Sam Cunningham upended at the 44, but the Swan is going in motion. The pitch is to Davis. Davis filled out of bounds. Second down, six. They run Davis. And he has slowed up that time. And a dusty, windy day here. Ray dropping, throwing to the sideline. Completing it to Lynn Swan. USC hasn't been able to move much in the ground. And the air has been different. Davis making that tackle. Forced down in the 35-yard line. Is replaced. <laughs> He's in there again at fullback. The option play. Oh, again. Renner on Mike Ray. What a charge by Gratishar. Ray fires deep to Swan. He has him. Laid it in there perfectly at the 25. Lynn Swan. How do you figure that one out? On first down. Ray again. Sideline pass. It's good to J.K. McKay. Coaches and scouts were downstairs talking to his son. And he wanted young J.K. to make his own decision. Ray, under the gun, taking away, throws it out of the end zone. Moore in. Cunningham is out at fullback. The option to Davis. Davis heading for the flag. Out of bounds on the two. Down there at the two-yard line now, digging in. There's a dive by Cunningham. Cunningham with his famous hurdling dive has put USC out in front. There won't be many people that will stop him when he gets in the air. Sam, I guess that's where he gets the bam, Cunningham. That line of scrimmage very quickly. Mike Ray's extra point attempt is good. A 57-yard drive by USC, mostly by passing. Timeout and the score now is USC 14, Ohio State 7. They're out in front 14 to 7. 
And Ohio State will get the ball for the first time in this half. Davis's kick is very short. Randy Keith takes it on the 23, and he is hit there at his own 30. Shocking news. Roberto Clemente, the great one, and the greatest baseball players of all time, lost, evidently killed in a plane crash, on the way to help give relief to those who needed it in Nicaragua. Archie Griffin down to the 31-yard line. Did you notice in drinking water there? We want to talk about that in a moment. Here's Griffin. And he's hit at the 23. USC now. Third down. Seven to go. Greg Hare shoots the pass. He's got a man wide open. And he catches the ball at the USC 45. That's Tim Holycroft. Keith breaks through 35 30 and pounds his way to the USC 27. Ohio State in the Southern Cal 27, first down. There it is to Griffin. And Griffin sneaks through. He's down inside the 10. First down. They spotted the ball at the 11. They said he went down. And Randy Keith and the full house T formation. Griffin. Third and five for Ohio State. Can he get this tough yardage inside? It'll even be more difficult now. And they go inside, and they don't get it. This will be a 21-yard field goal. Be spotted on the 11. And the kick is up. The kick is good by Brian Bashnagel. Hand up here on the sideline. They want the three points. They've got the three sure points. USC 14, Ohio State 10. Ken Kuhn. There's a cross kick again. And look at this. Cunningham has the ball. And every time they kick the short, they give a USC excellent field position. Midway in the third period. They send Swan in motion. A fake. And he fires, and it's a completion. Inside the 35 to the 33. Very few teams have ever had as many outstanding receivers on one college team as USC has. The pitch is to Davis. He spurts to the 30 and to the 26-yard line. Second down three for, uh, for USC. Davis downed on the 26-yard line. Third and three. Cunningham picks up the first down. Southern Cal on the Ohio State 20 with a first down. Davis squirting through 10. He's good. Anthony Davis does his victory dance on his knees. Well, they've had some great runners at this school. Cotton Warburton. Here it is again. Under. Suddenly, Kurt, the defenses on both teams have been exploited. That balance right there tears away from it. He stretches out. He'll give you that little leap. Ohio State develops fullbacks. USC develops running tailbacks. The kick is good. And now, for the timeout, is USC 21, Ohio State 10. Anthony Davis will kick off. And he booms this one. Bash Nagel coming back with it. And puts the ball on the Ohio State 36 yard line. That's a personal foul against Southern Cal. Greg Hare gives the ball to Rich Galvo. Yeah. Seven down eight. Eight is going to be a throw. Greg Hare gets it out, completes it, breaking his Archie Griffin, fumbles the ball, and let's see who has it. Ohio State, what a play that was. And Ohio State has the first down in the Southern Cal 47. Griffin. Second down, 10 to go for Ohio State. They're on the Southern Cal 47. And look out. 50, and he completes it to Griffin. Griffin's at the 35 and has a first down. Archie Griffin, and so has a sophomore, Anthony Davis, for USC. Ohio State's ball, first down. Trying to run that power slant. It only goes for two around the USC 33. 
There is it four out of six. The out. That's Running down there is number 49, Phillips. It was off the hands of Eddie Johnson, number 11. A bad pass that time by Greg Hare. 48 yards on that interception return. Swan going in motion. Mike Ray on the counter to Davis, 25-20. Davis breaks it inside the 15. Davis now has 145 yards on the ground. A sophomore. Play action pass. Complete to Charlie Young. And Young goes to the three. He must see if they dive Cunningham again. He's great on that dive play. There he goes, and he stops short. A flag is down, though. Offside against Ohio State. USC coming to life here in the second half. There he is again, and he's over. Sam Van Cunningham has scored his second diving touchdown. Well, you get another shot at it now. Everybody's trying to come up. Arnold Dave uh, Jones is trying. Rick Middleton is trying. And there you saw the safety man come up. That was Doug Plank, and he went over the top of Plank. Just everything. The kick by Mike Ray is up, and it's good. And USC has exploded in the third period. They have scored 21 points in this quarter. He's a left-handed quarterback in high school. Cornelius Green is the middleman now, and he's running up on this one and handles it on the 16. Gets back to his 29. First down on the 29-yard line of Ohio State. The pitch out is to Galvis. On second and 10, Greg Hare's pass is knocked away. Third and 10. Greg Hare. Can't find anyone open, and he's blasted down in his 30-yard line before the gun ends the third quarter because they have the wind at their back. Here's the kick. He gets the roll after what appeared to be a bad kick. That's the end of the third period. In the 1973 Rose Bowl game with a score, USC 28 and the 3-5. Anthony Davis to his 38-yard line. And they needed his passing arm here to break things open in the third quarter. Anthony Davis to the 40. Look at him go. He's to the 45 of 194 yards on the ground. As you see, he has 157. Bob Peter of Iowa set that record in 1959. And they're running him lot now. He's Flag drop. Too much time against USC. 22 years he's been an official in college football. Over the 50 they go to the 46. Third down and two. Cunningham sort of driving, twisting. First down. USC and the Ohio State 44. Swan in motion. Ray will throw it again if he can. On the run. It's complete for Young to tight end. And they drop him at the 31. Charlie Young. Charles Young has caught six passes for 82 yards. Rod McNeil. Cunningham in at fullback. Ray going to McKay. Incomplete. Third down. Seven. The rollout. And the toss is to Lynn Swan. Oh, this fellow's some kind of a receiver. First and goal to go, USC. The pitch. Swan fumbles the ball. And who has it? Looks like a USC recovery. Look at Ray's passing figures. 18 out of 25, over 200 yards in this game. Second and seven. McNeil. Cunningham is out blocking for him, and Rich Parsons, they have that Cunningham deep. Let's see if he dives again. He scored two touchdowns already. They give it to him, and is he over or not? Short. Southern Cal has been able to. Mostly because of that fella, Cunningham. How do you stop that? The third touchdown for him. 
on a tremendous diving fullback, Sam the Bam Cunningham. Sam has had a lot of air time. He probably didn't get a pilot's license. There he goes again. Pat Hayden will hold. Ray's kick is up. And the kick is good. And USC pouring it on now. In the fourth quarter with a timeout. The USC Trojans 35, Ohio State 10. All right, here we go now with nine minutes and 10 seconds to play. USC leads 35-10. It was 7-7 seven to seven at halftime. Davis kicking to Cornelius Green on his four. To the 20. Up to the 30, and he's down in his 32-yard line. The sophomore Steve Morrison of Huntington, West Virginia. See if he can move them some. Rich Galbo is playing his last game for Ohio State. Ohio State has 260 yards total offense. Harold Henson. His team played a gallant first half. Galbos to the 49. Second down, eight to go for Ohio State. Flags are down. Morrison's toss is grabbed off by Hinton, the cornerback of the 40s, up to the 50, 45, and is out of bounds. That's Charles Hinton of East Orange, New Jersey. First down in motion is Bulware. Looks like Pat Hayden's come in now. This youngster is quite a passer. And is complete the man for more at the 40. Gets his move to the 30. And is down. Just a natural passer. First down, Southern Cal on the Ohio State 26. The pitch is to McNeil. And McNeil is brought down on the 23-yard line. Of <laughs> Dancing through is McNeil. And he's to the eight-yard line, leading 35 to 10, six minutes to play. Seven to seven at seven and halftime. Pat Hayden. Brought down from behind by Randy Gratishar. Now has rolled up 427 yards. Total offense. Two yards away from the all-time Rose Bowl record. Here's Hayden's pass. And broken up at the goal line. Ray Washmara is in the game. There's McNeil. They just broken and he lunges in. But they say he stepped out on the one foot line. He's the deep man in that eye. And he's got it, and he scores. He fumbled, but he's over. He was over the goal line. Sam the Bam Cunningham gets his fourth touchdown of the game. Yeah, they weren't long ones. Yard, yard and a half, half yard. This is the most replayed shot we've had all day. He's pretty good. He ought to go out for the uh, high jumping team also. A new scoring record for a Rose Bowl game. The kick is good by Ray. All kinds of new records being set today by the mighty Trojans, who are indeed number one. Time out with a score, USC 42, Ohio State 10. The game, and she's seen USC really open it up here in the second half. Anthony Davis kicking off to Cornelius Green again at the 11. get far he's back to the 25 and against a club the caliber of Ohio State there. up the middle they go five here on the west coast as soon as this play is run off tell you why I mentioned that they run little Lippert the second string tailback the ball players we're seeing today Morrison the quarterback up to his 23 yard line First down for Ohio State from their 23. Rich Galvos to the 30 and gets up to his 32. And the future Mrs. Kern was a Rose Princess in 1968. Rex Kern can't be too happy about the outcome of this game. And Champ Hansen, they have scored 35 points in the second half, USC. Lippert to the 40, 45, 50, and into USC territory. First down, Ohio State. Lippert again, runs it to the 41. 
Second down, five. Morrison on a quarterback keep to the 35, out of bounds to stop the clock. First down, Ohio State. They're on the USC 32-yard line. Elmer Lippert again. And he's chased along the 30, and down he goes. Game has been produced by Dick Auerbach. There's the throw, incomplete, directed by Harry Coyle. They love that dog in that USC team. Lippert running it to the 25 and just directed a, a very brilliant attack that he had 72% of his passes. Ohio State still banging up the middle. And Steve Morrison throws. It's Smyrta, the tight end, who goes out of bounds with 47 seconds. They have to be a little bit concerned about this West Coast football. And there goes a touchdown. They hung in there and scored. John Bledsoe scores with 44 seconds to go. Boots it up. And good, 42-17 USC. Now he's ready. And they try an outside kick that goes about a loss of three, four yards. First down, USC at the 40. Pat Hayden gives the handoff to Allen Carter. 42 points they've scored on an Ohio State squad that lost only one game and had limited the opposition to just 12 points a game. And the crowd pours out the salute America's number one college team. It's all over. A final score. USC 42, Ohio State 17. It was close at halftime, 7-7, a tough battle in the first half, but the passing game of USC, their speed, their variety in offense, broke it open, and they won going away. A happy new year again, ladies and gentlemen. Kurt Gowdy and Al Dero got it. Stay, stay tuned now for the Orange Bowl right after station identification.